What's up YouTube? This is another episode of East Coast Power Cichlids coming to you here with another video and this video is going to be a special little unboxing and it's going to be really short but I got something in the mail. It's not a living animal but it's actually the complete opposite. Wink. Uh, and I just wanted to show this off on camera because I just think this is something that's really cool and it's something that I'm kind of getting into. So let's go ahead and, and, and dig into this. I'm not going to try and flawless with it, just rip that sucker open. All right, so I ordered these from a website called Skull Store Canada, uh, or SkullStore.com Canada. And basically it's a website where you can buy all kinds of fossils and bones and uh, entomology stuff like pinned butterflies and things like that. And they also have a lot of really weird stuff. So if you guys go and visit the website, I will just be I'm just going to warn you right now that there is a lot of really weird stuff. Uh, and, but the great thing about their website is that none of their bones or fossils that they sell are like inhumanely sourced or anything like that. Like they don't buy living animals and kill them just to sell their fossils. They actually uh, have all different sources that give them uh, animals that have died of natural causes and things like that. And then they just... Uh, turn them into skeletons that they sell, so none of it is, is uh, you know, cruelly um, collected or anything like that. So I guess you could say it's vegan friendly, if you will. So this little black box that I have here has some special little things in there. Start at the top, we have their card. So yeah, skullstore.canada. Uh, they actually sell like legitimate um, dinosaur bones on there. You can buy like Spinosaurus teeth and claws and like uh, stuff like that. They last time I checked, they had an entire um, uh, woolly rhinoceros skull that they were selling. So let's just go ahead and dig right into this. So I got two different fossils. I'll go ahead and pull out here before I show you. We'll ju just go ahead and get the box out of the way. So I ordered two fossils, one of which is this little fish right here. I got a fossilized fish uh, because obviously anybody who's been watching me for a long time or knows me knows that I primarily keep fish. So I thought it would only be proper that I get a nice little fish fossil. And I think this is pretty neat. And then the second one I got is a little bit more, um, I guess, typical to what you'd expect from somebody just getting into fossils. This is a little fossilized trilobite. Uh, the reason I got these two particular fossils right here is because, for one, I'm into fish, so I thought it'd be great if I got a fish fossil. And two, because, as you guys know, I'm... You know, if you, any of you have watched any of my most recent videos, I'm just getting into isopods uh, and things of that sort. And though trilobites aren't actually related to isopods, uh, they just so happen to be very similar to them for very similar reasons, despite them being unrelated. Uh, I think it just be I think it's just cool to have a trilobite because of how similar they look to the isopods. And these are legitimate, real fossils of a fish and a real trilobite. Uh, and I just thought it'd be really cool to get these. I don't know if they like paint the trilobite to make it so dark or if it actually is that dark, but I'm pretty sure they come this dark and that's normal. But yeah, uh, it was, this is just like a really short little fossil unboxing that I thought you guys would enjoy seeing. And these guys, and these two fossils will be put up onto display in my room so that uh, everybody can see them. But anyways, yeah, I thought I'd just share that uh, with you. The website that I bought these from will be linked down in the description for you guys to go check out if you guys want to go buy fossils or if you just want to go see what it's all about. They're not too terribly expensive. Um, for both of these fossils combined, including like shipping and everything, was like 40 bucks. So it's not bad, not sponsored, just I think it's a cool website. So that's all I wanted to share. Again, if you want to, go check them out. They're a pretty cool website. So, with that said, hope you enjoyed the video.
comment, rate, subscribe. Respect the hobby, respect the hobbyist, and most importantly, respect the fish. I hope you enjoy the video, and peace out. Bom, bom,